The Moto E4 Plus has officially launched in India and gone on sale exclusively on Flipkart at 9,999 rupees. Moto has also confirmed the offline launch of the Moto E4 in India at the price of 8,999 rupees. The biggest highlight, specifically on the Moto E4 Plus, is its massive 5,000 mAh battery. While both the new budget segment smartphones run Android 7.1.1 Nougat out of the box. We managed to get our hands on the new Moto E4 handsets at the launch event and here are our first impressions. First, discussing the differences. The Moto E4 Plus comes with a 5.5 inch HD display while the Moto E4 features a 5 inch HD display. On Moto E4, due to the smaller display size, the resolution does not seem that big an issue but with the 5.5 inch display on the Moto E4 Plus, the display appears to lack crispness. The E4 Plus comes with 3 GB of RAM while the E4 packs in 2 GB of RAM. In our short time with the smartphones, we didn't find any major issues with the performance and the Moto E4 and E4 Plus were both able to load apps smoothly. However, as we only had limited time with the devices and the units under discussion only had the pre-installed apps, we will reserve our opinion on the performance till the full review. In terms of storage, the Moto E4 Plus comes with 32 GB of built-in storage while the Moto E4 comes with 16 GB of storage. You can expand the storage on both smartphones via micro SD card. The Moto E4 Plus features a 13 megapixel rear camera while the Moto E4 comes with an 8 megapixel shooter at the back. At the front, both smartphones feature a 5 megapixel sensor with a single LED flash. Thanks to the LED flash support, the images captured by the front camera appear to be pretty good in our short time with the phones, as both the E4 Plus and the E4 do a good job. However, the images taken from the rear camera turned out to be pretty average. Once again, we will hold on to our opinion on the optics till the full review of the phones. Compared with its predecessors in the Moto E series, the most noteworthy thing about the Moto E4 and the E4 Plus is their design. The new handsets feature metal casing and come with a circular camera module that has now become a trademark for the latest Moto smartphones. Neither of the smartphones is hard to hold in one hand, but the large battery capacity and display on the Moto E4 Plus ensures that the smartphone has a little taller and thicker frame. This brings us to the Moto One key navigation feature on the Moto E4 and E4 Plus. The home button on the front of both smartphones, which also has a fingerprint scanner embedded, can be used for one-handed navigation. The smartphone uses force touch to recognize the gestures on the home button and helps users navigate through the platform. While this feature can be useful in certain situations, it doesn't seem to add great value to the device as of now. In this price segment, the Moto E4 will be competing against the Xiaomi Redmi 4 and Yu Eureka Black in India. On the other hand, the E4 Plus will be going against other smartphones with large battery capacities including the Lenovo K6 Power and the Asus Zenfone 3 Max. So that was our quick look at the Moto E4 Plus and the Moto E4. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe and follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram.